SP gang, it's your girl Shanti Young, and your girl is back with another video. I'm back with another little banger. I ain't gonna lie, this is a banger for real. But I'll be doing a reaction video. If y'all know what's going on on YouTube, what the whoop, what the whoop, y'all will already know what I'm finna react to in this video. So y'all probably like, you finna do a reaction video to it. Yeah, I'm finna do a reaction video to it because, like, I'm curious and I wanna know. No, I wanna know. Hello. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's what I'm doing is a reaction video. I'm gonna tell y'all what it's gonna be in the next clip. So, if y'all gonna be ready, go and give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. I saw y'all new to my channel whatsoever. Subscribe as well. I'm on the road to 9K. Get your girl there. Don't forget, because period. And yeah, let's get right into the video. What I will be reacting to today is Karina. Y'all know Karina? Karina and Flo, or whatever, when they was together. So basically what's going on, what the woo, they saying something about Flo, whatever he did to Karina, what the woo. That's what's going on on YouTube. And I'll be reacting to a video she posted, I think yesterday, it said My Truth. She telling us about what really happened or whatever. So yeah, I'm going to be reacting to gonna be reacting to it. So that's what I'm finna do. And I'm not going to react to the whole thing, just a couple of clips or whatever. Because, like, I want to know what's going on. And the video already, like, 44 minutes. So, no, I'm not going to react to this whole video. So, yeah. Let's going to get right into the video. Yeah, Karina's so pretty. I do have something to say though. I feel like nobody should be putting their hands on nobody. In the first place. That's what I feel like. She's saying. Toxic is not and good in a relationship. Always say, like, Flo, if you feel like you can't be this person that I'm not gonna say be the person that I need you to be, but at least show me a little bit more love, a little bit more affection, and you know, just actually be there for me after everything that I've been through. Then you can just let me go because I know that there's better out there. Like, I know that. So I told him and I explained this facts. To him, if you feel like you're not in a good relationship, leave it. I mean, your girl just wants you to spend more time with her. I mean, is that too much to ask for? That's all I was asking for this whole relationship, for real, for real. A lot of stuff escalated because Flo, he doesn't take that well. Like, when I say something about how I feel about something, he would more think of it as nagging or not, like, actually considering how I feel just because he only wants it to be about him or he wants it to be the way that he wants it to be. But it's not that way, though. It's like, you but... know, being just let me go. Like, you knew I loved you. You knew that I had a weak spot for you, so that's why you held on to me so long because you, you just know that you're not going to experience love like the love that I showed you. And you won't. Like, you'll never get the vibe or the love that I gave you because you took advantage of it the whole time. I have been nothing but good to flow. I, I have never tried to hurt flow. I've always been there for him and tried to be the best person I could be for him. I was so nice to him. And 
All I ever felt was just like, for real, for real, like. Y'all, she finna cry. Yes, I am aggressive and I. I, I hate seeing people crying. Mad sometimes, but. I can tell them how you always. Like, I've never fought them to hurt them, like, or to kill the nigga, like. And, like I said, there's been altercations where I haven't put my hands on him and he's put his hands on me. So, what he's not gonna do is sit here and try to make it seem like I'm the aggressor in the relationship. One thing about it though, for niggas, just because a female get on your nerves or something, that don't mean the right to put your hand on the female. Not at all. I will say, niggas that hit females need to be in jail because that's not good at all. And if you're in a relationship like that, leave it. And that's supposed to be your girlfriend, but you ain't saying nothing. You ain't a real nigga. That's all I'm saying. Did nobody 
trying to so defend the girl? If she said let her out the car, let her out the car. Um, you don't never just ignore a female that say let her out the car. Let her out the car. If she don't want to go with you, she don't want to go with you. I want to get out the car now. Like, I want to get an Uber. I keep saying that I want to get out the car now. I want to get out the car now. I want to get out the car. I cannot tell you. I'm literally in the car, like, really upset about what the fuck is going on. Like, I'm like, that shit's so wrong. So, we on our way back. They saying that I hate Flo while we was in the car. I'm not going to lie. I did put my hands on Flo while we was in the car. Because I seen him call a girl's phone. So I'm like, okay. I punched him. He said. One time. One time. And I did not punch him to whoop his ass. I did not punch him to, oh my God, I'm going to beat the fuck out of him. No, I did not do that. It was a one punch. And it wasn't even that hard of a punch for him to even feel like he needed to re retaliate. Because he did not retaliate. He did not need to do none of that to you like, in the first place. Basically, was like, okay, like, no matter what, he didn't know you to do that. So I'm like, okay, yeah, that's fine. And after that, I'm just like, bro, let me out the car. At this point, it I'm don't like, matter like, how mad you I'm get. Like, you don't never hit a female. Like, no. At this point, like, I'm really over this shit. Let me out the car. I'm not going back to this house with you. Whole time, I'm trying to leave. If Flo would have let me leave from the beginning, none of this shit would have happened, period. Like, hey. if you would have just left me alone when I asked to be left alone, none of this shit would have happened. Facts. Somebody is holding you in a fucking car. Like, at this point, what the fuck do you do? Right? Like, like, what? I'm like, okay. It's like you I'm being kidnapped or some shit. Oh, shit. Hey, Jesus. 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 Oh no! This sounds like some other shit to me. I ain't finna lie to y'all. How this sounding to me? You punching, dragging, and hitting on this girl right here. A nigga doing that to a female. Are you serious? Yo, I ain't finna say too much. All I'm doing is react to a video. But what she's saying, this shit is like crazy. It's crazy. Like what? That's all I can say is what? I can't believe it. That's foul. That's wrong. Disrespectful. If I hear something else again that happened worse, I'm gonna go and end this right here. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Cause I don't like that. This shit sounds so freaking wrong. Like. If she's trying to get her phone, give her her phone. phone like, hours, what? Hours hours. Like, what you mad hours, for? Hours, you mad because she said she done? She I mean, obviously you hit her. Like, why not? Not standing by the I door. Not letting her out of the house. And Yeah, this stuff sounds so freaking wrong.
leave. Every time we get into it or something, my goal is to walk away. Like, I'm quick to walk away because I'm not going to be sitting here doing all this. But the nigga be making me stay. And that's why I always end up being a bigger situation than it has to be. Because I hate, first of all, don't stand in front of no door. Right. No room, bro. Right. That bothers me. That upsets me. Because it's like, right. bro, I like, feel stuck. And I hate feeling stuck. So, of course, I'm going to Like, at this point, what is you finna do? To get out of the fucking room. So, basically, that's what I'm doing for hours. I'm trying to get Flo to to give me my phone so I can leave and to get from him out of front of the door. So, of course, I'm going to have to try to move him or push him. Exactly. Or provoke him. Because you're trying to get the fuck out. So, he can see that I'm serious about what the fuck I'm saying. Like, I'm not playing with you. Give me my phone. So, we, um, I can't remember if I pushed him or what. But I know I did not go and punch on him. What I did, I think I pushed him, trying to get him, like, away from the door. And then that's when Flo, he started punching me. He punched me like two times. And that's when my first lump, my, my lip first busted. And my nose got hit too. Because I could tell it was swollen. So I'm pretty sure that's when he broke my nose. So after that, uh, me and Flo, I got back up. And we just still, I'm still going after my phone. Can I get my phone, please, bro? Can I get my phone? Like, at this point, why is you not giving her her phone? Like he said. Please, no, don't give me, don't. Basically, tell him he didn't want me to leave. So he was not trying to give me my phone. But it's like, I want to leave. So keep watching it because because like what why would you do a whole female like that because like what that's a whole female who does that to a female you need to be in jail right now i'm not gonna lie to you that is disrespectful i don't care how mad you get i don't care about none of that you don't ever put your hands on no female and especially how you just did her how she's saying it that's wild and like like what That is unbelievable. This is just crazy. I don't like hearing them like that. Like, that's just so wrong. I'm like, what? And I, I like the beginning. She said the beginning. All she asked for you is be, be there for her. Show her more attention. And just spend more time with her. That's all she asks. That, that's hard to get. Come on, then. You have to do all of that. To your female. That's foul. That's real foul. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I ain't really got nothing else to say. So I'm just gonna end the video right here, though. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, they're real disrespectful. I don't like hearing stuff like this. I really do not. This got way out of the character. And I thought it was gonna be. I ain't know it was all of this. Like, that's crazy. But y'all, if y'all enjoyed the reaction video, make sure y'all go and give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. If y'all new to my channel whatsoever, subscribe as well. And um, I want to say one thing for boys out here, men, whoever. Don't put your hand on no female. If you feel like you can't stand her or you getting out of control around her, that don't mean put your hand on a female. Because, like, you don't do that. You don't do that. It don't matter how mad you get. It, you don't do that. That shit gets foul. That's all I'm going to say. And like I said, I ain't going to say too much. All I know is I don't like this. 
It ain't good at all. Okay. That's all I'm gonna say. But love y'all, SP gang. Bye, y'all.